welcome to Spirit Not Spirit Day. So today we're going to talk about how to find your spiritual teachers. I remember when I started this journey, I kept thinking, I have to train under someone. Um, I don't know anything about this. How am I going to find my tribe? You know, they say you vibe with your tribe, but I was like, the people that I was around, I knew I wouldn't be around for very long. Um, and people will start on a journey with you, but folks will go in different directions. And you may excel faster than the people you're training with or you're studying with and just require different things for your spiritual journey. So I kept saying, like, who are my teachers going to be? And I remember looking online and, you know, thinking maybe some people could offer something to my journey and just kind of taking a bit from here, a bit from there. Um, but somehow it was never really a good fit. And then one day I remember just kind of staring at the sky and I watched the sun go down. And as I watched the sun go down, I started to see some codes and I started to see things in the clouds and I started to see things on trees, on the moon. And I realized, wow, like I found my teacher. Nature is my teacher, literally. So, you know, you may feel like the way I felt, right? How am I going to find my teacher? Who am I going to train under? Do not feel committed to um, or obligated to joining a religion or a particular practice. Just explore a little bit of everything and you will know. You will get in where you fit in or you will fit in and get in right? That's literally how it works. So I wanted to share this message um, that nature can be your teacher. Um, your teachers will come from places that you least expect. I will uh, connect some of the videos to this one. I'll put the links in where I talk about, you know, just feeling like where I was going to get my answers from. And it came from places that I least expected. Um, so just be open to the journey. Do all the research you need to do, and you will find that uh, many of the answers you already have or that the questions you're asking is because you've already experienced this in another lifetime, and you're just kind of uh, jogging your memory, if you will. Right? You need that trigger to kind of put you in the right direction. Consider it breadcrumbs, right? You've probably all laid already laid the breadcrumbs in previous lifetimes and now it's you picking up those breadcrumbs to find and walk in your purpose. I hope you found this video helpful. I'll look for you in the next one. You're always welcome to Spirit Knox for Brooklyn Mosaic. Blessings.